Azores, it's a beautiful Portuguese island surrounded by Atlantic Ocean. This is a place where we can fish fresh salt water with a huge variety of fish. I asked two friends if they want to join me in this crazy wild adventure, but I told them this is going to be tough. The fish is going to be difficult and the terrain, the mountains, the rocks, the fishing spots are going to be extremely hard, but shore fishing is all about that. <laughs> fishing for a huge variety of fish, micro finesse aging to uh, marrow fishing on the rocks with some swim baits and some jigs and uh, you can have the four seasons in one day. Sometimes it's extremely windy and the sun appears in the next 10 minutes. That's the cool part about the, this island. The big waves and the wind didn't play as fish as much as, it, as we wanted because big waves and a lot of wind, but we didn't give up. We talked with some locals, asked for some directions and some spots. We ended up in a fishing harbor where the locals usually fish and is protected from the waves and from the wind. The locals are extremely friendly. We also sleep in Rabut Peish. It's a village where Turn of the Tide, the Netflix series was filmed. Sometimes the people might get the wrong idea and impression of people because they think it's all about drugs but that's completely wrong. The, the fishermen there are very friendly. Atlantic Ocean is the main source where they get money to feed their families. Come on, cast, cast, you can cast there, it's more than one. Cast, cast, cast. it's a nice one. Cast. Oh, that's a nice one. Look at this. Azores, fresh water, beautiful perch. <laughs> beautiful perch and lots of rain. really really windy and we just came to the lake where there's a lot of perch and uh, a lot of carp, Xander and on the first cast we are on. On the live target Sonic Chef there are a lot of these perches and they are, oops sorry, they are beautiful. It's very very windy. Let's release it and put everyone with one of those in our hands. Let's release it. Nice man, that's really good. Oh. Bye bye. Oh. Yeah, that's a nice one. She was right behind the weeds hunting. Oh man, that's so cool. Look at this. That's so damn cool. Stop. Look at this beauty. Beautiful perch behind the weeds. Look at this. Now time for salt water. After all the struggle and the climbing, Furnas Lake was fun and produced a lot of fish. It was time to try our luck on salt again. Our only option was fishing on the harbor, but first we stopped on a small village to fish with some kids and showing them how funny it is to fish on aging. Excellent. 
here. <laughs> Ribeira Grande producing some cool fish on aging. Easy. They are so funny to catch, man. Beautiful. <laughs> Just playing with the kids here in Ribeira Grande in Açores, and I hooked something really big on the aging with one gram. I have no idea what it is, but old man speak. <laughs> I don't know if I can lift this fish. <laughs> oh, that's a big. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fishing these girls on such a ultra light gear on the aging, it's so so funny. Come here, girl. Andy. Oh, oh my god. god. Look at this. It's so cool. <laughs> it's so so cool. Look at this. We have we have been fishing a lot of these girls, but this is the biggest one. Trust me, it's really, really cool, cool to catch these girls, such light gear and this micro finesse, one gram. The fall, when you're fishing with only one gram, the fall is very natural and you don't even animate. You just let the aging worm going down. We're not going to release this fish, we're going to give this to these kids because they are the locals. <laughs> The sun was going down and that was the prime time for the barracudas to enter the area. First, my friend Elvish hooked a pretty decent barracuda. Hey, hey, hey. It's a barracuda! Nice! Nice! <laughs> Even that small fish is a runner, man. It's insane. Nice, finally. You need help? <laughs> it's okay, man. Fine. The way we are struggling, a fish is a fish. Yes, nice. <laughs> oh man, that is so damn cool. Woo! Look at it. Amazing. <laughs> Look at this. Even the small ones, they are such a predators. That's nice it. run. Let's release it. Good job, man. I'm so happy for you. And after that, when it was already pitch black, I hooked a meter one. A dope fight on a very strong fish that destroyed the slow row shiner five inches. Wait, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on. Big fish. I'm on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on. Cast, cast. Big, 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 big. Big fish. Big fish, man. Look at the rocks. Oh, it's on the rocks. Oh, come on, get up. Oh shit, oh my god. Look at this beautiful barracuda. After, <coughs> this is insane. After three days on salt water without any bite, struggling, risking our lives, we came to the marina, the sun was setting, and this beautiful barracuda just to swallow this life target five inches. <sighs> Slow retrieving. Insane. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Nice. In the next days, we played around in some deeper areas, catching some pretty cool fishes that are always a reward when you're shore fishing. This island is a small paradise with a great variety of fish, friendly people and very good food that you have to visit at least once in your life. Here we go, we're going to drop the fish, we're going to drop the fish next to the fish pants. 
Aqui vem para cá e ninguém sai de cá.